everyone. This is your girl, Dam Sean, back with another episode of Facts on Barbara. And today I'm going to talk about my weight loss journey. So anyone that follows me on my platforms know that I have uh, lost about 35, 40 pounds. Uh, gained about six, but we're not going to talk about those six. We're going to focus on how I lost those 35, 40 pounds. So um, I'm trying to think. It was either late in the 2020, beginning of 2021, I had got up to like 216 pounds. Yeah, 216, I'm only 5'2". Yeah, but I was still fine. <laughs> Ooh, big fine. But that's not the point. I had to get to the point where I was wearing ankle weights because I couldn't carry the weight. I couldn't walk. I was just like, my, my back was hurting. I went to a doctor and he's like, you're way overweight for your height. They wanted to run tests to check my cholesterol, diabetes, and to my left band surgery. No, we're not going to do that. So he was like, when you come back, you know, if you lose 10 pounds, we can, you know, start, you know, talk about how to keep going. I was like, I'm going to lose these 10 pounds. So first thing I did off the top, I stopped eating sweets because I have, I'm, I love sweets. Roll over the middle of the night, my sleep eating cookies and candy and stuff. I'm a wine drinker, so I would drink not a one glass maybe two three glasses of wine and uh i love I like soda so i cut the sweets out i cut the soda out and i stopped drinking wine for like a month now i'm not gonna say completely like i may have had a soda maybe once a week but during that time when i was trying to get the, drop those 10 pounds and let me tell you when i stopped snacking the soda and cut down on the wine that 10 pounds came off easily so once i seen that happened and i was and let me tell you something i am not a very consistent person so i don't never i don't i will switch over and forget and do something else and not okay i'm done with it but at this time i didn't give up so when i say this is a lifestyle change it is a lifestyle change it really is and um i'm actually proud of myself because i don't stick with nothing nothing so after i lost those 10 pounds um so you know I had a co-worker at work and she was determined she was on it so she gave me the motivation to start doing more so she introduced me into the like the meal replacement shakes and so i would do a meal a meal replacement shake in the morning one in the afternoon then i would try and i would eat a, a meal and when i came home from work but i would stop trying to eat after a certain time like eight nine cut off so i did that consistently ooh, for months and I, I dropped the weight. And I, I, every time I went to the doctor, I was down three pounds, down five pounds. So, yeah, so that adds up. So, like I said, it's not easy. Let me tell you something. It's not easy. The cravings are there. You're going to want them. It's going to, I mean, and I did incorporate. I didn't, I'm not going to lie. I said I did a whole lot of exercise. But I did start incorporating at least about 20 minutes a day of exercising to get my metabolism up. And so, with, between the the meal replacement shakes um cutting down on sugar that uh sodas the uh the wine all that played a big part so yeah that's how i lost the uh, my 35 40 pounds i um stuck to it like i said it's not easy it's a lifestyle change if you're not gonna change it if you're not ready to just do a 360 and cut everything out and be dedicated to losing that weight then don't and don't waste your time because you're gonna do it for a week and then you be like i can't do this so, but yeah, I was determined because 216 was a lot on me. I was still fine. <laughs> I mean, you know, but it was taking a toll on my body to what I knew I wasn't the same person. So I had to get that extra weight off me to feel better. And I want to be here in the long run for my kids. So I know I need to take care of my health. So with that being said, you know, um, I did meal replacement shakes. I did a little 20 minute workouts every day. I, I, low, I cut down on my sugars, my alcohol, my sodas. And um, the weight came off. It really did. And it, like I said, um, I got down from 216 to about 180. And now, so I maintained that. <laughs> I've been slipping lately. So I'm up, up, up six pounds. But, you know, after my mother's death, I kind of, you know, it happens, you know. But I, I know now what to do to maintain a healthy lifestyle. So I had got a lot of questions asked about how I lost weight. And that is how I lost weight. Um, so if you have any suggestions or want to drop it in the comments or other people to see, 
I'll be glad to read them. I may need some more because I got to get these six pounds off me. My birthday's in four days. Doubt if I get off six pounds in four days. That's like on a water diet. But hey, you never know. But yeah, so yeah, that is how I lost my weight. I uh, cut my sugar intake. I cut down the wine. I cut down the snacking. I watched my, um, what I ate. And I, and I really, I cut out fast food. Fast food is the devil. So I cut out the fast food. And so once I seen the results, it made me more motivated to keep going. So that is how I lost 35 to 40 pounds. So, which is going to lead me into my next video. BBL, self-care, or trend. Hmm. Stay tuned.